Is it okay to listen to the Quran for pleasure, for example, when driving, when doing house chores, cleaning, etc.? Somebody might be puzzled by the question because they might say that, okay, if you're driving and doing just chores around the house, if you're not listening to the Quran, then what else are we supposed to be listening to? Okay, maybe listening to some lectures or something like that, but that becomes a little bit difficult to do because you're trying to follow someone's train of thought. Then what else? If we're not supposed to listen to Quran, what do you want us to listen to? Music? So somebody might be kind of puzzled by that question. Well, let me explain. The question stems from a very real place. There is a verse of the Quran that says, وَإِذَا قُرِئَ الْقُرْآنُ فَاسْتَمِعُوا لَهُ وَأَنصِتُوا لَعَلَّكُمْ تُرْحَمُونَ Allah says that when the Quran is recited, when the Quran is read, then listen very, very carefully and be quiet so that you may receive the mercy of God. Okay, so that's the verse. So that creates the framework for the fact that when the Quran is read, you're supposed to pay attention and be respectful towards it. But if I'm driving, um, while I'm driving, of course, I might get a little distracted here or there. I might have to answer my phone or whatever. Or you're not supposed to talk on your phone while you're driving, but you get my point. All right, you might have, I have kids, right? So my kid from the back might be like, Abu, Abu, what about this? What about that? And now all of a sudden I'm talking to my kid, but the Quran is still playing. I might be doing chores around the house and then also, and somebody texts me and I pick up my phone, I'm texting them back, but the Quran is still playing. So yes, ideally, you try to sit down and have some quality time with the Quran. I know some might agree with this, but this is just my very humble answer in this regard. I feel that if somebody's really trying to build a relationship with the Quran and they really enjoy spending time with the Quran, I personally am okay in recommending people to play it while they're driving their car, to play it in their home while they're doing chores or just, you know, at home with their kids or whatever the case may be. I am personally okay with that. And I understand it's not ideal, but then you make some five, 10, 15 minutes of ideal time with the Quran, but I am personally okay with somebody playing the Quran in the background, so to speak. I personally was benefited tremendously from that as a child. And that's why when I sat down to start memorizing the Quran, I realized a couple of juz of the Quran, I already knew them and I didn't recognize that I knew them just because they were played in my home so often during the years I was growing up. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us from the people of the Quran. Jazakumullahu khairan. Wassalamu alaikum.